Hey guys, Jake Fernley here. I'm gonna take you on a day in the life with me at TCU or Texas Christian University. So I thought I'd give a little intro to me. So my name's Jake Fernley. I'm from Edinburgh and I attend TCU, Texas Christian University in Texas, uh, Fort Worth, Texas. And I'm part of the National Player Program uh, in tennis, Scotland. So for me, TCU was an easy decision. It's a very small campus, um, maybe like 10,000 students, not like the campus you saw in Connor's video. It's a lot bigger campus and it's just, a, it's, and it's a very pretty campus. I mean, it's, it's pretty modern, but there's also aspects that are, aren't so modern. So I really like that aspect and I like the people. Um, everyone's very friendly. And yeah, it's just a great fit. The weather's a joke. Also on the tennis front, the coaches are unreal. David Ruditi, Devin Bowen, Derek Siddiqui. They all care so much about, about the players, uh, about our, our tennis and improving. So that's really important. And the team, I love the team. I knew Alistair Gray, who's from, the, who's from England actually, um, who loved it here and couldn't say anything bad about the place. So that really sort of helped me in my decision. And just American college experience in general. I mean, I don't think there's any place where you can play this competitive of tennis whilst getting a degree. Uh, so that's sort of why I made this decision and I don't regret it at all. We get so many fans to every match. It's the level is unreal. Like you get professional like players with ATP ranks playing like all the time. And it's just great to be part of a team. I mean, I don't think once you sort of maybe go onto the tour, you don't really get to be part of a team. So it's just a really unique experience and one for me that I love so much and that I'll never really forget about. So that's sort of the main reasons why I came and why I would recommend college tennis to, to anyone who wants to. Here we are, the Greek, Greek village, that's what they call it. A lot of greenery, very modern buildings. So it's just a very nice place to, to be, to walk. And yeah, the students here are extremely lucky. So I'm just heading into our sort of tennis complex and where we get all our work done as a team so I'll show you guys around. So I'm inside the, our tennis building so I thought I'd show you or I'd give you guys a quick tour of, of our place. First off this is sort of our main little area. Got a little recovery table in there in case we need some work done before matches. Also got a little recovery room in here where we've got a lot of stuff. Um, stringing machines, two stringing machines. Our stringers work extremely hard. I'll just take you guys down here. We've got head coach, David Roditi, assistant coach, Devin Bowen. And then we've got our kitchen. It's not very well stocked, but you see, Everything highlighted, smart snap, recovery, pre-fuel, yeah, all the good stuff. And then we've got our locker room. Pretty nice. <laughs> I won't show you my locker, but there you go. Jacob Fernley. I don't know why that says Worcester. But on the roster it says I'm from Edinburgh, but I'm not. I'm not actually. They they messed that up. So I'm just at our indoor courts. Uh, where behind me is our little sort of gym area where we can we can lift, we can do recovery. It's got everything we need, uh, and it's lasted us throughout the season. And it's it's been great because because of COVID we weren't able to use the other gyms. So this this gym is, is just for us and just for our men's and women's team. So. We come here pretty much every day to just do something and it's situated in right where our indoor courts are and you can see we've got five indoor courts preferably we'd like six but we can't have everything and then up there we've got some cardio equipment or versa climber versa climber 
and yeah, and football. I don't really know what that's doing yet. So yeah, let's get into it. Within the same place as the pool, we have the wreck. Got the swimming pool there, pretty nice. Then we've got, go down here. It's pretty nice, like this is where all the students come and work out, have fun. There used to be a sort of restaurant there, but because of COVID, and you see that guy sprinting up there. And then if we walk through, we've got the climbing wall. Never used it once. Don't think the first people I've ever seen using it. Got this hall. Pretty nice. So I showed you sort of our building, but now I'll show you sort of outside and we'll head down to the courts where we play our matches. Uh, I'll give you a little view of what we see from our locker. So, I mean, I don't think you get better than that anywhere in college tennis. I mean, I don't, I think, I know I'm biased, but I think we have the best tennis facility in the whole of the States. A lot of people won't agree with me on that, but that's just the way it is and this is where we walk down to practice every day so here are our courts got some stands and then here our purple courts they're known as the purple courts and then here we've got our women's team or some of our women's team the committed ones the ones that are staying for the summer working hard and working hard playing points with Coach Lee. So yeah, but I mean, you can see how nice of an environment it is to play. You're surrounded by trees, a lot of greenery, and yeah, I don't think there's, there's better courts in the whole of America. So yeah, it's just my opinion. So I thought I'd give you guys an apartment tour. So here we go, we got the kitchen, um, fridge, little living area dining room over there, I've been really lucky to get the accommodation we got, um, seeing as my, me and my roommates are only sophomores, so we got put in an apartment. Coming to my room, Scottish flag, there you go, some pictures on the wall, me at TCU, yeah, it's, it's pretty tidy, it's probably the tidiest it's been all year, so I thought I'd show you Guys, so what I do to sort of sign off at the end of the day, I usually either just listen to music and I have a chill out sort of playlist that I listen to, or I watch Netflix. I just finished watching the Drive to Survive um, F1 uh, series in about a week, so that was really good. And I also watched Sea Spiracy yesterday, um, which was extremely interesting, and I would, I would definitely recommend that. So oh, thanks guys for watching the vlog and um, don't forget to like, share and I'll see all you guys soon. Take care.